Hi everyone, this is Shivani here. Welcome to my channel Shivani Creations. Today I am showing you how to make this gorgeous and very attractive paper quilling envelope with the weaving pattern. Yes, this weaved strip is completely handmade and this is made using paper quilling strips in 3mm. It is looking very very attractive. You can just open the envelope like this. So without any further delay, let's start with procedure. First I am showing you how to make the envelope. For this I am taking the sheet which is 21 by 23 centimeters, and from both the sides I have creased on 1 1 centimeters. Now I am folding these creases and burnishing it very well using bone folder. Then rotating my sheet and from left side I have creased on 7 centimeters and 15 centimeters. Again I am folding these creases. Then from both the sides we have to cut till the center part on this 1 cm scored line. And ta -da! The envelope is ready, super duper easy to make. Now we just need to stick both the sides with these flaps to construct the envelope. And this is ready to use. Now to decorate the back side. Here I am taking this beautiful punch by Dress My Craft and making the gorgeous border. Like this. Now it's time to start with weaved pattern. So here I'm taking this white color cardstock strip which is 19 by 2.1 centimeters and now I'm taking off-white color strips in 3mm and from one corner or one side I will start adhering these strips. You just need to align it with the top corner and then uh, one by one just stick it like this. So we have added total 7 strips. Now it's time to stick pink color strips on the top. So again I'm aligning it with the corner and then I will start sticking these small pieces of strips till the end. So this is completely covered. Now we will start doing our weaving work. So here I am just folding all the pink strips in the front side so that it will be easier to weave. like this. Now I am taking my first off white strip folding like this and then I am just skipping three strips and passing it under fourth strip like this. Then I am skipping total five strips and passing it under sixth strip. Again skipping five strips and passing it under sixth strip so we just need to repeat this step till the end and push the strip topward so that it will set nicely and 
first row is ready very easy to make I have just skipped five five strips and passed it under the next strip now we just need to secure this off white strip from back side I'm adding little glue and just sticking it like this so that it will not move so first row is done now I'm proceeding to the second row now this time I'm skipping two strips passing it through the next strip again skipping one strip passing it through the next strip then I am skipping three strips passing through next strip again skipping one strip passing through the next strip and we need to repeat this pattern skip three pass under one skip one pass under one and repeat it So second row is also ready, very easy to make. Now I am starting with the third row, skipping first strip, passing through the next, then skipping third strip, passing through the fourth and we just need to do this repetitive till the end. I am here using simple weaving technique alternatively. Each time we have to skip one strip and pass it under the next strip. So in short we have to make the checks pattern. Repeating it till the end and the checks pattern is ready. Very very easy. Now I am starting with my fourth row. So folding my off white strip. Directly passing through the first strip and then again repeating it alternatively like the checkers pattern So completing this till the end and after doing the checkers pattern again it will look like this. So we have reached uh, till the fourth row that is the middle part of the pattern. Now we just need to repeat the remaining three rows in just the similar way as we did the first three rows. We have to do the mirror image. So after doing all seven rows our pattern will look like this. It is looking very very beautiful and attractive. Now from back side we have to secure all these pink strips. So I am just adding little glue and sticking these strips. chopping the excess strips which are a little longer and also securing my last off white strip and the beautiful weaved pattern strip is ready it's looking very very beautiful you can choose any color of your choice now to decorate this little more I'm taking here same border punch and here I have used gold mirror cardstock to cut the border so I'm just decorating my weaved strip using these border designs from top and bottom now taking back my envelope and exactly in the center I am going to stick this weaved pattern
लाइक दिस वेरी वेरी ब्यूटिफुल यू कैन कीप योर ऑन वल एज इट इज बट आई एम गोइंग टू डू लिटिल मोर डेकोरेशन सो हियर आई एम टेकिंग दिस डॉयली कट आउट एंड स्टिकिंग इट इन राइट कॉर्नर then i'm starting with making my quilling flowers so here i'm taking half strip of blue color and 1/4 strip of white color sticking both the strips together and making one malaysian flower petal wrapping this petal using white color strip and just securing it similarly we need total 7 petals to create one flower now i am joining all the petals together and adding half cut pearl in the center and the beautiful flower is ready then for the next flower i'm taking half strip of light pink color in 3 mm and making one malaysian flower petal again this time i'm using single color for the pink and wrapping it using pink strip only then i am just joining six petals to create the flower adding half cut pearl in the center and flower is ready similarly i have prepared one more now i'm starting with making the leaves for this i am taking dark blue and light blue color strips making one leaf shape i have taken half strip of dark blue and one fourth strip of light blue so leaf is ready now i'm joining total 3 leaf shapes together to make one complete leaf similarly i have prepared one more and also i have already created these scrolls using white light blue and dark blue colors i have just joined two scrolls together to create this beautiful bunch now taking back my envelope and i will start decorating it using my handmade quilling patterns like this then randomly here and there i am just adding some blue color pearl drops you can also use sequins like this and the super pretty and very gorgeous shagun envelope is ready you can make it in many color and from back side you can put money So that's it for today hope you enjoyed my video please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos and please click on bell icon for the latest updates and notifications i am waiting for your comments thanks for watching see you next time bye